Hi there, Tina here from Miss Daisy Patterns. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make this cute ghost plushie. His name is Hello Boo. He's completely made from plushie fabric, some felt, craft filler, and most importantly, the pattern for this guy is free to download from my website. Now, I'll leave the link in the description box below. If you want to follow along with this tutorial today, if you just pop over there, download the pattern, print it out, and then let's get started. Right, so what you're going to need to make Hello Boo is some black felt, some white felt, and some pink felt. You're also going to need some knitted plush material. Uh, the measurements for this is in the description box below. You're also going to need some craft filler, some thread, some pins, a needle, sellotape, and scissors. Now, you should also have the pattern downloaded at this point. So what you'll do is you'll just cut this out and you'll be sellotaping it together along the dotted line. Now I have a section already cut out. Right, so this is one I've prepared earlier. Right, and as you can see here, Boo the pattern has been cut out and completely joined together. So I literally lined up the dotted lines and then sellotaped the pattern together. Right, so if we start on pinning, and you'll see here that the knitted plush material, it's it has a it's a stretch, so it can either stretch width ways or length ways. And what I've worked with is I've been stretching width ways. Right, so if you just remove all the pins, that's great, and you can see where I've taped it on the back and the front. That's the pattern. Right now, what we're going to do next is we'll unpin all of the felt sections. So that is uh, the eyes, the pupils, the black pupils for the eyes. You're also going to have the cheeks, right? So if we lay them out, that's the cheeks, that's the two eyes, and then the pupils are positioned in the center. And if we just remove that, so as you'll see, that lines up. This is where we're gonna put the face. Ah, right, hang on a second, forgot the mouth. Right, so that's the mouth. Right, so again, Remove the pin and we can just position it. So that's the mouth. Great. Now we have all the pieces. Right now, the next step is we need to position those on the face. So that's as positioned on the face. Now you can use the pattern itself as a guideline. Um, it's very flexible. You can actually position it in any way you want. Right. And to begin with, what we need to do is we need to attach the black felt to the white felt. So we're going to whip stitch applique that basically the pupils of Hello Boo's eyes onto his eyes. Now the instructions to all the stitch, all the stitches used in this in this pattern in this tutorial um, are all linked in the description box below. Right, so that's one eye done, and you literally repeat that on the second eye. So that is the first stage. So that's the second eye done. And then the next step is we need to attach all of these onto the actual plush fabric. Right, so we whip stitch applique the first eye in, pos in position. Great. And then to finish off, what you do is if you just do a few stitches, a few back stitches on the reverse of the fabric just to secure the eye in place, and then you can snip it off. Right, so now what we need to do is we need to attach all the other pieces. So that's the second eye on. Now for the fun bit, this is the mouth. Now we can have him as a sad ghost, oh, but I think I'm going to have him as a happy ghost. Absolutely happy ghost all the way. Right, so you whip stitch applique the mouth into position and then the cheeks so eyes mouth cheeks all whip stitched into position right, so that's that done right now the next step is if we cover hello boo's body with the other section that we removed initially. 
right now this is this is quite important and uh, the pattern has got a marking and on that marking there what we want to do is we want to leave that section on sewn so we'll be able to turn Boo right side out once he's all sewn up. So if you use those two lines as a guideline and then pin. Now I like to pin with the point of the pin facing, facing towards the um, edge of the material. And then we just pin all the way around. Right, and then this next step basically is to we're going to back stitch around the entire circumference of Hello Boo. Now I'm leaving approximately um, half a centimeter, give or take seam allowance, but I'm hand sewing. So just make sure when you're hand sewing and you're going through because it's the it's a plush fabric. That you go through all the layers and that you're grabbing each side of the layer as you're going around and i find it's easy to just keep moving it as you're stitching so just move it as you're stitching and take your time that's it completely sewn all the way around if you remove the last pin and then do a few back stitches in place that'll secure it great so that's basically all the sewing, well pretty much nearly all the sewing done. Now remove the pins right, and we need to turn them right side out through the hole that we've left on sewn. Now generally what you do is you start by pushing in the arms first, then the head and then you can pull it all the way through. Now, it might take a bit of fluffing out to actually get all the curves completely out. And also you can check to make sure that you've actually stitched it securely all the way around. Right, so that's that. And then the final section is we need to stuff Boo. Now when you're stuffing them, it's easiest to start by stuffing the arms. So you stuff the arms, both of them. That's the second arm stuffed and then we're just going to literally fill Boo with craft filler. Now he does take quite a bit of craft filler but you just keep stuffing and stuff all around the circumference, all the edges into all of the curved bits and then finally if you stuff just the last section in and around, so I always leave a kind of a space around the belly area, um, that's the last bit then. You can pretty much tell when he's completely stuffed. That's why I said that's about it. Yeah, that looks good. Alright, so we don't need any of the, we don't need any more craft filler then. So we can get rid of what we have here and and we just need to close up that hole and that basically is you whip stitch that closed very simply whip stitch closed yay hello boo is almost finished right so and that is hello boo finished Thank you so much for watching this tutorial today. I do hope you really enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Till next time. Bye bye.